getting together and just showing off our work to each other. Can I see it? Yeah! I really like this one. What do you think? I call it Smile in the Abyss. It's, um, it's a smiley face. Well, yeah, but, but it's symbolic for the almost unattainable happiness of the masses, being suppressed by immobility and a rigid social hierarchy and political elitist domination. But it's a smiley face. That's not art. I can do that. This is postmodern art. It transcends normal art. It has life and meaning. Yeah, no. I don't see it. Sorry. Well, I suppose it is a bit too sophisticated for the untrained eye. Hey, how's your report coming along? I just finished it. Wow. That's deep. That's not deep. That is a smiling face on poster board. What are you talking about? It obviously symbolizes the unattainable, unattainable happiness that to the masses is a crime. Hey, right, I've heard it before. What does it mean? What does that even mean? I suppose it can't be held in corrupted by the social hierarchy and, and for your creativity. Wait, no, I just, uh, just ignore me. So how's your piece coming along? It's great, it's one, one of the very best pieces yet. Even better than your last piece, the <coughs> tree much of she of madness. Better. Much better than that. This one's called Fox of the Leaves. I can't wait for the show tonight. Can I see it now? Sure, it's right here. Wow, so ingenious! Uh, thank you. Wait, no. That does not have any meaning whatsoever. This is a rock on a leaf. It's not a sculpture, it's not a painting. She probably brought it in on her way in here. What are you talking about? Do you realize how long it took me to work on this? I planned it, I sketched it. It took me so long to get these exact materials. Materials? Yes, this is a rock in a leaf. You are so uncultured and insensitive. I'm sorry. I, I don't mean to be mean, but I mean, I I just won't talk anymore. Good. Hey guys, is it okay if I use your kitchen? Oh, that's totally fine. Thanks again for cooking for us in such short notice. No problem. You guys are so artistic. I just love your creativity. Oh yeah, tonight's show is going to be one of the best yet. I mean, everyone's pulling out their greatest for this one. Just check out Rupi's piece. Whoa, that is so good. Thank you. What does it say to you? Well, I'm no artist, but it seems like the leaf is a lifelong dream, and the rock is the upper class minority crushing it. That is exactly what I was getting from it. I mean, just the depth of this whole Hello, piece. Hello, everyone. <gasps> Sorry to interrupt. When I was looking for my notebook, I wanted to add this poem to it, but I couldn't find it. I think I saw it in the bathroom at the red and the same time. Oh, and before you get it, can you read the poem for us? Well, it was kind of spur of the moment, and it's not quite finished yet, but I suppose I could read it out loud. <clears throat> Stars streaking across the looming darkness, sunset on my soul. Hearts tearing wide, spilling their unguarded contents for all to see. A show of freaks, four freaks, as we melt as one into a pool of despair. Bravo! Really good. Wow, that left me speechless. Thank God something did. What? Um, I said, uh, I don't get it. Don't get what? The poem. It's like a bunch of lines just drum together. It doesn't even mean anything. It's a memoir of the depressed. The pool of darkness that surrounds us all. Yeah. Okay, we better be going if we want to get our stuff set up. Oh, okay, yeah, see y'all guys. Thanks for coming again. Yep, no problem. Bye. I forgot the celery. Okay, what are you doing with all this stuff? Oh, this is 
want to see it? Oh, 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 let me guess. You call it Sea of Garbage, and it represents the struggle of the oppressed and the... Man. 